Alright, Bismillah, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh, Bismillah wa salatu wa salam ala Rasulullah. Now, uh, today inshallah, I'm going to do a reading. This will be Unit 4, Lesson 3. If I, sorry, Unit 4, Lesson 4. And uh, Kitabana, inshallah, the day is Mega Goal 3 to the third of the third. Now, let's go to the third of the third. So we are actually here on page, I think it's 64. Alright, now, the story of the past, we know that we went with each other in the conversation or the conversation between Asma and Nura, and we are currently in the conversation with our television or TV. Alright, so after the show we saw here, we are today talking a little bit about some of the vocabulary or the vocabulary that we will take today, inshallah, in the part of the reading. Now, I want to give you a quick introduction. Today, the reading is going to be about the television or TV. Not now, but how the TV was actually invented, how it was made, and the names of the people who made or invented the TV, and the progression, the progression that happened in the TV over the years. So, you will see the names of the people, the experts, the experts, you will see the history, حتواجه معلومات علمية على كيف تركيب TV أو تلفزيون وتطوره إلى ما صار عندنا تلفزيون الحديث اليوم. Alright, so these are some of the words we read them last time. طلبت منك إنك تدخلي أونلاين أو تفتحي قاموس وتحاولي توصلي ما بين الكلمة ومعناها. So let's check and see what you did. Now أنا عندي الحل فخلينا نقرأهم بس سريع مرة ثانية. One evolution, number two distinct prototype, transmit, patent. Milestone, affluence. Now, خلينا نشوف الحل ونشوف إذا أنتي حليتي معايا صحيح. طيب نجرب نشوف. هذا حلك. خلينا نكبره شوية. All right. This is. This is your. Oops. This is actually your answer. Huh. Let's see. Sorry about that. All right. There we go. So these are your answers. Let's read them quickly so we can get to them in reading. For number one, evolution. It means all together. Evolution. Evolution. Last thing. This is actually B. Evolution is the development. So development is a process in creating an idea, or a development of an idea, or a device that is present. The gradual change, the changes, and development of an idea. If I ask you to break it down, evolution means break it down between the word evolution and the word. Change. إذا شوفتي evolution and change, تعرف إنه هي هذه الإجابة. Number two, distinct. Distinct لما يكون شيء مميز فا ويكون مختلف عن غيره فإجابتك حتكون G. دليلك هنا حيكون كلمة different. If I would actually go use the word different here. فعندي كلمة different بتنفع هنا كدليل إذا تبغي عشان تربطي بينها وبين معنى كلمة distinct. Distinct. و different كلهم بحرف D إذا تبي تفتكري. Number three عندك prototype. Prototype يعني نموذج أو model بدائي للجهاز أو المكينة أو الاختراع يكون أول نموذج نقدمه عشان الناس التانيين أو الشركات والمصانع يصنعوا على أساسه. For prototype ممكن تربطي بينها وبين كلمة model. إجابتك حتكون C والإجابة ممكن تربطيها بكلمة model. Prototype و model. Number four transmit. Now transmit زي الكلمتين اللي أخذناها yesterday. وكانت موجودة عندك في المقدمة حق تي في and we talked about air and broadcast فلما you air a program البث broadcast a program برضو بث لبرنامج على الراديو أو تي في we transmit فانتقل المعلومات they are transmitted through the air إلى ما توصل لجهازك وتشوفيها انت فF send out transmit بمعنى send out إرسال أو بث Number five, and here patent. Now patent is very important. The meaning of the idea. لازم توثقي إنه هذا الشيء أنت اشتغلتي عليه. Something that you actually made and something that you invented. And to protect your rights, حفاظاً على حقوقك, you need a patent. It is a piece of paper, and you have to get it to sell the new product that you have. For patent, had to be number E or letter E. It is the right, الحق, to make or sell a new invention. I will connect the word patent to probably the word new invention. new invention. Because you always need a patent. 
Number six, milestone. Now, milestone or mile step. ممكن نستخدمها بكلمة step. A milestone is usually um, it is it is an event. It is a step. هي خطوة أو مرحلة من ال تجربة أو من ال 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 مرحلة مرحلة معينة في تجربة إنك تخترعي حاجة أو تكوني أو تصممي invention أو اختراع. But a milestone are the steps that you take. كل خطوة الاختراع التخطيط البيع الشراء. Each one of these نعتبرها milestone. So هنا بتكون a very important event or development. حدث أو تطور of something. I would actually link the word miles, milestone إلى maybe an important event. منها فعلا نقطة مهمة مرحلة مهمة في اختراعك أو شغلك. فأربطي كلمة milestone مع important event. Number seven, affluence. Now affluence is actually G. Affluence is when something is really different. And usually when you're trying to invent something, how did اخترعي? You usually plan to make it different. دائماً تكون جزء من الخطة أن يكون اختراعك different. جديد, different, مميز. فأربطي ما بين affluence و different. All right, let's go back to... All right, let's end our presentation right here. Go back to the reading passage that we have and check what we see here. All right, so this is number... Uh, eight, and this is reading. And before we start reading, we have a little comment here. Television is popular around the world. Why do you think it is so popular? How much do you know about television? Now, to answer the question of TV is very popular and information, how much do you know about the TV? You do have this part here for reading. Now, we could actually read this, but I, instead of just reading, let's check the questions that we have here at the bottom. Okay, now it is a long passage, but as I said, it has a history, it has a history, it has a TV. So, take your time, please, and we are going to read the questions and answer them. Because if highlight highlight important points. So, it says here after reading, and we're going to do it before reading. Let's answer the questions. Let's see. Question number one. Explain what the two main schools of thought were in the early days. Early days, two main schools. Now, the question is very important. It depends on the على رأس السؤال دائما explain means to تشرحي أو تكلمي عن الموضوع explain the two main schools كلمة two مهمة جدا في السؤال معناها يبحث عن حاجتين دوري عليها فوق القطعة main schools مدرستين المهمة في the early days حق التي في so خلي بالك خلي في بالك الكلمتين هدول two main schools let's go back to the paragraph or the passage هندور عليهم حطي بالك كمان this is question number one فالإجابة على question number one بتكون في بداية القطعة. Let's go back and see. فين ممكن تكون؟ Now remember, we're looking for the word two and we're looking for the word schools. Let's check. Television. Da, 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 da. You know what? I think we should read the first three lines. عشان تعطينا مقدمة بسيطة. A brief overview of the history of television. Television was not invented overnight. ما اخترعوا في يوم واحد. Or by a single person. No, it was more. The work of many people over a number of decades, سنين وسنين وعقود, contributed to its evolution. تمام. حلوة. It's all about the TV والتطور والevolution اللي صار في TV. Now, افتكر الكلمة اللي كان نبغاها كنا أول. نبغى نسأل عن أو نتكلم عن the two schools اللي بدأوا في التفكير في TV. هنا عندك in the early days. Ah, هنا two موجودة. Schools موجودة وثات موجودة. All right, now سؤال كان يقولك explain يعني اشرحي. فحنشرح شوية عن the first school. إجابتك حتبدأ من هنا. حتبدأ من in the early days two schools مدرستين of thought in technology influenced different researchers and the course of their investigation. All right. If I were you, لو أنا بجاوب على السؤال ما حكتب هذه الجملة. حبدأ من الجملة الثانية. حقول the first 
one of the first school was based on the technology of this guy, Paul Nipkaus, rotating disks. Now, I would actually do this, the first one, All right, the second school, the second school, or the second one, was based on an electronic television system, television electronic, مش ميكانيكي زي الأول, that used a cathode ray tube developed by, ممكن أحط اسم الشخص نفس الشيء. Now, you don't have to write the whole thing في إجابتك, حطي خط إذا تبغي في كتابك, على إنه the first school كانت based on the technology حق فلان, وكان ميكانيكي. The second school كان based on Campbell, Swinton, and Rosing. هذولي ثلاثة المخترعين. وكان إيش؟ Electronic. ما هو ميكانيكي. All right. نروح السؤال اللي بعده. Question number two. ننسى أحد. How did Philo Farnsworth, اسم الشخص هذا مخترع تاني, transmit an image? How did he send a picture through to the TV? And how could you actually get the picture on your screen? What did he use? Okay, let's check and see. All right, Philo. Where is Philo? Let's check and see. Now, the question is about Philo. Let's find Philo. Where is he? Where is he? As I said, this is question number two. But you will find the answer after the question of the first question. The questions in the exam, the questions in the exam, the book, 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 will probably be here for the paragraph number two. Let's see. Where is the name of the inventor? Philo, Philo, Philo. There he is. Philo Farnsworth, this and this and this. And the question is, how did he send a picture or an image? Now, you'll find the name. And the word that image, there it is. But how did he use that? He said he used the dissector tube. All right? He used a dissector tube. And you should ask him what is a dissector tube. So he can send a picture or an picture or an image. Which is, we should ask him what is a the basis of all current electronic televisions. It's something that is used for all electronic televisions in the All right, good. Now, you have to give history and the history of Philo. He's an American engineer. You have to give some of the things that he made. You can tell you that he started doing things like this when he was a little in high school. Okay, we know that he used a dissector tube to send the images. So, you have to say, using the dissector tube. Good. Let's go to question number three. How old is the concept of color TV? Now, when we talk about color TV, we are used to having colors on our screens. But years and years ago, like your grandmother, your grandfather, they probably saw TV in black and white. I'll be able to ask it. So, the question here is, like, how old? Now, when I say how old are you, had you 15, 16, 17? Here, they're asking about how old is the concept of color TV. Again, the masalik how old, hatatini rakam. So probably here the same thing, hatirjai, and you will find either a number. Oh, hadu hatasili li tarikh. Let's check and see. If you want to see a number, you'll either find a number or a date. Tarikh. Number, 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 خلصنا من هنا القطعة الأولى خلصنا من فيلو فارنزورث ننزل تحت القطعة اللي بعدها yes this is where we stopped وقفنا هنا عند فيلو فارنزورث نكمل بعد شوية ونشوف a lot of people ah oh, here it is color TV color television معنى الفكرة حق ال color television حتكون هنا we're looking for a date the number of years من متى هذا بدأ هل هو جديد ولا قديم let's see in actual fact the earliest proposal was Wow, 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 wow. So it is very, very old. How old is it? Well, it's started in 1904, and and now in 2020. So this is very old. If you count the numbers, so 220, now I guess 1904, 60. Wow, that is almost, let's see. That's almost a hundred, that's more than a hundred years. That's more than a hundred years. Okay? So more than a hundred years here, if you 
count the numbers, we will get it. And you can actually answer the question is from. I'm going to put here. إجابة. Let's see. We're going to get it. Yep. Okay. So إجابة دك ممكن تكون from nineteen o four. This is your answer for question number three, and it's a very old concept. All right, we're good. Let's see if we can go back here. Uh, very good. We'll quit. Oh, good. All right. So how old is the concept of TV? From 1904. Number four. Why is television called the tube by some people? All right, let's check and see. And this will probably be here on this side, when there's Andrew Jehtania, and we'll talk a little bit about why do people call it the tube? It's a little shwaya. Oops. Very good. All right. Let's look for the word tube. Ashan Shuf. Why some people, but they may go to TV, they actually call it tube. All right? Now, so this is here. Let's check and see. This is John Baird. If you have a disc. ما شوفنا كلمة توب إلى الآن انزلي انزلي كمان 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 ها all right here ها okay Vladimir Zworykin he one of was one of the inventors طور شوية في التي في إيش حط إيش جاب إيش سوى هو بنفسه the inventor of the iconoscope transmission device as well as the kinescope now here because of what the work that Vladimir did all right a lot of people كم اللي معي تحبت لقي كلمة Tube. Yes, there it is. Mojud. So why do they call it the tube? Many people in Britain that use the word tube to refer to television fail to make the connection between the television set and the cathode ray tube. So the reason that people call it tube, مو عشان استخدام التوب أو الكاثيدر ray توب اللي اخترعها فلاديمير في سبب تاني. Nor do they stop and think about the meaning of the word television. No, no, no. What happened is, what happened is, it was just an expression that eventually came into use because of this. So probably Vladimir called it that way. Some of his friends probably said, oh, but it was بالاسم the name of this. But a little bit of people who come back and know the real meaning of this name is the name of this. But they do call it the tube, according to the array that was used in the television that was invented by Vladimir's work. All right, now we come here and we tell you the same thing. We tell you that his work and invented many devices. He won more than awards and awards. But it's very interesting here to read. All right, let's do question number five. How did Parker system affect developments? Ah, okay. So there's another guy here called Parker. So I'll give you the how. I mean, you want to ask me about the way. And you want to ask, you want to job on the effect. حق السيستم حق باركر اون ذا ديفلوبمنتس. All right, the effect يعني تأثير باركر على تطور التي في. Let's look for Parker's name. فين باركر؟ فين باركر؟ Here he is. This is Lewis W. Parker. Good. مطلوب انك تقولي what did he do for the development of the TV؟ خلينا نشوف ايش من انجازات باركر. Let's see. He he patented ها آه, صار عنده براءة اختراع. The intercarrier sound system. All right. So this is his part. مشتغل على الامج الصورة. مشتغل على التوبين اللي جوا. مشتغل على الساوند حق التيفي. Which is also very important. فحد حطي الإجابة. Lewis Parker patented the intercarrier sound system. مشتغل على الصوت حق التيفي. All right. Good. Question number six. Read the text again. اقرأي مرة تانية القطعة. Find each inventor's name, اسم المخترع, the name of his invention. في الخانة الأولى تحطي year, السنة, المخترع, the invention, اختراعه, and the approximate year. السنة موجودة في البداية حطي لياها. Write the information in the chart along with the effect that each invention had on the evolution of television. Now, أسهل عليك شوية. All you need to do here, choose a year, سنة. اسم الشخص المخترع الاختراع اللي اخترعه وإيش ممكن تأثيره على TV now like for example you had let's do the one that we just did حق Parker مفترض إنك تبدأ من بداية القطعة أنا حسوي آخر جزئية هنا أو بسوي اللي أنا وصلت عندها لأنها قدامي وقريبة من السؤال 
بليز ابداي من بدايه القطعه وشوفي كل المخترعين نعم هير وي هاف لويس باركر ممكن نحط اسم باركر عندنا الانتر كارير ساوند سيستم هذا اختراعه وعندنا التاريخ اول رايت سو وي كان اكشلي دو ذس هير ليتس جيت اور بن جود سو اتس 1948 ذا نيم اوف ذا is Parker and the invention is the intercarrier carry sound system system and what was the effect well it had effects on sound الناحية اللي في التي في أو جزء من التي في اللي هو كان يشتغل عليه في حالة باركر كان يشتغل على الصوت أو الساوند All right, good So this is what you would do هذا مثال كملي بليز إلى آخر الجدول Okay All right, let's remove this here All right Let's go down to speaking Now, this is a very small uh, part that you can actually practice doing with a friend or a sister You can also use your phone. You can 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 use your وحنشوف حق المجموعة حقك في الفصل إذا كنا موجودين في المدرسة بس حالياً ما يمنع أن تتناقشي مع صاحبتك أختك أمك أهلك في البيت الكوشنز التالية من باب أنه uh, تشوفي مفضلاتهم في التي في 1. Which TV shows are the most popular among your friends? مسلسلات series movies أفلام uh, competitions or quizzes مسابقات عددي الأشياء أو البرامج اللي مشهورة بينكم Number 2. Why are these shows popular with your friends? ليش؟ Why are they popular? Uh, because of the time, because of the place. ممكن يكونوا يصوروا في مكان خارج المملكة، في مكان جميل. أو ممكن يكون بالعكس داخل المملكة، وملفت جدا للنظر. Uh, ثقافي، تعليمي، uh, fun. إيش الأسباب؟ Number three, what do you like about these shows? What do you like most? Do you like the people in it? Do you like the pictures? Do you like the story? The last one, what do you dislike about these shows? What do you don't like about them? A time in Egypt? عدد الحلقات الشخص اللي فيه write the stuff that you don't like alright so these are things for you to discuss with speaking please قضي شوية وقت مع أهلك مع صحابك صحباتك وناقشي الأسئلة هذه about TV alright thank you very much